hello everyone and welcome back to my channel i hope you are doing good so today i'm going to show you how you can create a form in view so in my previous video you have seen that i've shown you event handling and input binding so both the concepts we will be using while creating form so let's get started with today's video so in my previous video i have created this form for input binding and event handling so let's just stop remove all these so i'm using an example component i'm just going to remove extra inputs and i'm just going to keep input names so you can see i'm having one form and inside that i'm having just one input name and button click me that is there so let me just do some formatting um the this input is in four line let me just remove uh, key up and let's do it in one line only so now let's change click me with submit and also remove at the rate click here because right now we will be submitting form not a particular button or something so here now that's the basic template right now now let me show you in browser once you are having just input name here and there is one app hello is appearing so also remove that so now let's start by creating our form so firstly in data i'll be defining one form object and inside that i'll be taking all my input fields so let's say name as a blank email as a blank after that phone let's say phone as a blank and then message also blank so now in v model we will be defining like form dot name form dot email like that so in name write form dot name so now let's copy input name and paste for email so change label email then now type also we need to define so type, define type text as name then input type email and here we model in form dot email name also email so let's create our next input for phone change label to phone after that let's change name to phone and we model also form dot phone so next and last input that i'm going to create is uh, for message let's change label for message Actually, I forgot to change a type of phone. So let's change to type tell. So now let's change input to text area and also end it with text area. Remove type, we don't need type here. And on a change name message and also v model form dot message. So now our contact form is ready. So you can see name, email, phone, message, all those things. So now let me show you in browser how it's looking. So you can see all the fields and text area also. So now let's add required to all the fields. So add required to all fields. Now let's submit this form. So to submit this form, we will be using submit directive. So directive we can call using at the rate and with that direct. So at the rate submit and also dot prevent event modifier the as we don't want to submit it like usual we want to submit is using our function so let's pass our function handle submit and in script also create same function and inside that let's console our this dot form now let's check in browser inspect and now let's uh, fill the form so i'm just going to fill with random name and email phone number also and type something also in message and now let's click on submit so in console you can see so in console you can see all the four fields is present and its value also present that i have entered into the form so if you are using view 2 then this form can work for you you can use the validations using v validate but if you are using v3 then there will be a lot of changes that you need to do because validation will be a little different in view 3 so I'll be showing you in my next video how to validate your form using the validate and also using yup. So that's all in this video. I've just created a short video on how to create a form because if I'll show you validation in one video, that will be a very large video that I don't want to. So here in this video is just form creation and in my next video, I'll show you how to validate your form. So thank you so much for watching. Please like, share and subscribe to my channel.